So in September 2020, I became CCNA certified. It took me one and a half years. I failed it twice, got it on the third try. It was tough. Now it's been about, it's been two years, pretty much exactly two years since I got my CCNA. Now I'm CCNP certified. Encore and Anarsi, so two times. I think the CCNP was more complicated and technically harder than the CCNA. And there was two exams. The study material was a lot more intense, had to do a lot more labs, really had to know the material a lot more to get it down. But I would say, interestingly enough, I think the CCNA, in my opinion, was still harder than the CCMP. And I think the hardest part about the CCNA was kind of like not, you kind of had like a imposter syndrome. So you're still kind of new to IT. Like when I was doing the CCNA, I was still new to IT. I was just in help desk. And I, I still was kind of finding my footing in tech. And I still wasn't confident in myself. I wasn't sure if I was in the right industry yet or not. Wasn't sure if I was like smart enough or capable yet of all these, this tech kind of work. But with the CCNP, the CCNP while I was studying for it, you know, I was already CCNA certified. I was already a network engineer for a bit. I was already a system admin for a bit. And I've been a DevOps engineer for almost two years now, or about a year and a half. So, you know, the CCMP, I came into it with a lot more confidence. Like, I was very comfortable being in the tech world as an engineer. So, studying with, for the CCMP, it's like, all right, I'm kind of like destined to do this kind of work and I'm comfortable being here. I've got a good work record. I haven't really failed a job yet. I mean, like, I could do the work. So, I, I'm, I know that this is the right field for me. So, that gave me a lot more self-confidence. I'd, I felt more worth in myself, so studying wasn't as difficult. So the biggest resources I used to pass my CCMP was mostly real world hands-on scenarios and experience that I gained working in DevOps or as a system or a network admin. I used Boson exam simulator. I used a lot of practice exams. I went through Reddit. I went through a couple of Udemy courses. I went through CBT Nuggets. So I, I didn't really study from one specific place. I kind of studied from as many places as I possibly could because the CCMP, there's a lot of material in there and there isn't, there isn't just one stop shop for it. And I think that, you know, I've been seeing some people on Reddit going for their CCMP the first time saying that they want to get it done in like a month or two. I think that's crazy. And if you can get it done in a month or two, well, hats off to you. But me personally, it's taken me two years to do it. So I think that you shouldn't necessarily rush it. I think the best thing to do is once you get your CCNA out of the way, you can kind of just focus on getting a job, getting some experience, getting that hands-on knowledge so that when you're going for the CCMP, things make a bit more sense and you feel a bit more confident that you're in the right place and that you're looking for the right jobs for you. So if you already got your CCNA and you've already been in the IT, working as a network engineer, cloud engineer, DevOps, just start going for your CCMP because CCMP, it ain't going out of style. Networking exists everywhere in IT. Doesn't matter if you're doing security, coding, systems, networks, cloud, data science, what, no matter what you're doing, everything is connected by the network. So CCMP, knowing that shit, is never going to hurt you. It's only going to increase your marketability and your skills and your knowledge of how everything ties together in the workplace. Go in the description below, join my Discord channel. We have tons of free resources on CCMP, CCNA, any kind of cloud or security cert, and a lot more. And you got a lot of peer support on there. So feel free to join, hit us up, introduce yourself, and come study with us and up your game.
I hope you found some value in this video and I'd like to thank you guys for watching. should be